Okay, here we are again with another episode of Jesus, that was a shitload of work. Um, I uh, took on the Final Fight ring stage this time, which you know, was problematic. Uh, let me show you why. Oh, I think I saved it in the wrong state. So here's the ring stage. Um, Notice how you know it's fixed. It doesn't scroll. It's only 384 by 224. That's it. It doesn't have the assets for anything else. I mean, we're screwed. Um, you know how do we do it? So basically, the answer involved a lot of uh, clever positioning of elements and breaking up graphics uh, into smaller chunks. Uh, and, and and let me show you uh, you know how it turned out here. So but but I just want to point out though. You know, you notice that we have like four columns in the background. We have the um, we have the we have the buildings in, in the in the far background. We have the characters. We have you know the mat, the the, the ring, the cage, and, and uh, the moon in the background. These are all the elements that we have to deal with. So you can see this actually turned out uh, pretty damn well. Um, it basically, uh, I, I haven't, I haven't, you know, ripped all the frames of animation from the crowd in the background. So some of the animations that are missing, I still have to hook those up. But basically, the math is all sound and uh, and everything works. And notice how when you're playing 16:9, it actually makes the um, the roof uh, beams. Uh, you know, it actually makes them, you know, size differently, so they're farther apart. It, it's, it's actually calculating this. So I actually ripped out the graphics for each individual beam there, and and made it position dynamically depending on the aspect ratio that you're running at. And and let me and let me show you, you know, other, other stuff that's going on. You notice how the crowd kind of filled in too. Um, the state, the rain can be infinitely wide. So let's just go crazy here and say. We're going to play uh, 32 9 aspect ratio. And so, see how it's just infinitely wide, and see how the uh, distance between the beams in the, in the roof just keep getting farther apart. It basically, it's just all calculated, you know, you know works like a charm. So, so, basically, there we go. This uh, stage is unlocked. It now works at any aspect ratio, any screen resolution, any size. I'm probably going to add in an animation on the moon just to make it scrolling, just because this is all about you know gratuitousness, so might as well. Um, and you can see how you know it works out well too, even if we decide to play at uh, four three. So if you want to play, you know, on an old CRT monitor or whatever, you know, no problem. Um, you know, that still handles. And actually, the thing that, that that was really satisfying about this, the thing that really made me turn up my chin and pat myself on the back is that the formula that I have to calculate the distance uh, between the uh, beams and the roof, when I apply that formula to a 4-3 aspect ratio, it just so happens that it's basically just about identical to the position of the original beams, uh, you know, in the original game. So basically, you know, it's perfect, man. It works. Um, and, and you can see, too, how, like, basically the way the formula works is... Um, in the original game, in the cage background here, there were nine, um, you know, of these things. They're basically like this. The cage here was broken up into nine chunks, and so that's pretty much what I do. Um, I just have like a repeating background for the cage, um, and I and I and I pull out, ripped out the graphics, this two pixel wide uh, bar, and I basically just calculated to say like, okay, I want to have nine of them. So how wide do they have to be for there to be nine of them? Um, so yeah, you know, the, so it's basically the uh, the bonus stage where you uh, you know trash the car that is going to get the same treatment as this, but the but but this you know was kind of um, the other one too is going to have to be the elevator stage in the, the industrial zone. That one is also fixed width, but but it's doable though. I, like I I have I have plans for those. I I I can handle that. So basically, Final Fight will finally be completely unlocked. You'll be able to play it in any aspect ratio. Actually, let's get even really let's get really crazy here. Let's go beyond 32.9. Let, let's let's make the resolution 2560 by 320, and see how ridiculously wide this thing gets. Holy shit, that's a lot of ring. 
So yeah, it's like Raging Bull, basically. The ring is just infinitely wide, uh, depending on what you want to do there. And you'll notice that at this like ridiculous um, uh, aspect ratio, it, it does hit a point where um, you know, it just so happens that the calculation leaves a little bit of a gap between the guys in the middle and the, uh, the guys on the left and right. And, and basically what happens is, the, um, the the repeating uh, you know sprite for the uh, you know the, these, the crowd in the background here is um, 142 pixels wide, and and basically what I do is I just calculate you know how much space that we have you know uh, between the center uh, guys here and where uh, you know these things should start, and uh, and I basically just figure out how many of them I can safely put there. Uh, you know, how many I could safely repeat. But, uh, yeah, this is pretty goddamn satisfying. I mean, this is why I'm making this thing. You know, Final Fight has never been completely unlocked. In, in fact, I don't think anybody has completely unlocked an old game like this, you know, updated the assets to make it all uh, work like this. It's, it's, it's pretty cool.